Good morning, everyone. My name is Danny Shelton, and I'm 43 years old. Uh, my wife and Sarah and I are, have been married uh, roughly for about uh, seven years now, and we have five kids. Uh, Austin is our oldest. He is 16. Uh, he's a sophomore in high school right now and a former uh, well, football player at Wayne County. He's on decided what he's wanting to do currently. Uh, then we have Gabrielle, my oldest daughter. Uh, she plays basketball on the middle school program. Um, Kaylee and Dakota, uh, they are, uh, they love playing soccer, uh, very outgoing, love to just have fun. And Logan, my baby boy, he just absolutely anything with a ball he loves to play with. Uh, but basketball is his favorite. One day he has assured us he's going to be in the NBA, and I hope that dream comes true for him. Um, we live in a little small town on the uh, Kentucky-Tennessee border. Uh, Monticello, most people probably don't know what Monticello is, but they've heard of Lake Cumberland. Um, I've lived here my entire life. Uh, I'm an only child, uh, so growing up was kind of lonesome. I did have uh, uh, a couple of buddies that lived here in the neighborhood that were like brothers to me, and we were always usually together riding bikes, uh, tossing the baseball around, shooting hoops, uh, just, just, you know, whatever kids would get into at that time. <clears throat> so, uh, I'm your non-traditional student. I graduated from Wayne County High School in 1994. Uh, most of you guys probably wouldn't even alive then. Um, I, I currently work there uh, as a uh, tech assistant, uh, helping with the Chromebook, Chromebooks and stuff for uh, the high school students. Um, an interesting story about that, uh, whenever I was uh, fresh out of high school and stuff like that, I, I, I got my first job as a factory, decent paying job for here. And uh, after about, I'd say three years, uh, the factory closed and uh, I made a decision to go back to school. So in the fall of 1998, I wound up enrolling at uh, Cumberland, what was then Cumberland College, now Cumberland University, and wanting to pursue a uh, a teaching degree. Uh, but after a little bit, and funny enough, uh, I guess I kind of got scared away because the public speaking. Then uh, uh, I decided to change my major to uh, something in business. Unfortunately, I don't remember exactly uh, what it was in business, but anyway. Uh, after a few months of college, I, I'd been working a late shift and it got to where I, my classes, they were all morning classes. I started missing a few of those because I was sleeping in. And eventually, uh, by the end of that semester, I decided uh, to return back to Monticello and uh, pursue working back in uh, a different factory where I worked there for a long time, making fairly decent money. Um, well, I worked at a couple of different factories at that time. And um, the uh, last job that I had, uh, it uh, I wound up uh, finding myself unemployed again. So I decided at the age of 42, it was time to try to go ahead and finish up that uh, degree that I'd started. Uh, shortly after getting enrolled at Campbellsville University, uh, which I love it here, I love the online, I love the students and uh, the interaction. I just think it's awesome. I love. Uh, Loved all the professors I've had so far, and I'm sure the ones coming forward will be awesome as well. Um, shortly after getting enrolled here at Campbellsville, uh, like I said, I, I got my, I'm working at the high school, and I currently got that job. And uh, I decided that uh, maybe this was the Lord's way of saying, uh, you know, maybe you do need to get that teaching degree. Uh, so that's what I'm currently trying to pursue. Uh, I did fail to mention earlier, I am a child of God. I got saved when I was very young on a Christmas Eve. Um, uh, of course, as I got older and into my teen years, I wasn't necessarily the best Christian. Uh, I have failed God a lot, and thank God He never fails me. Um, but uh, anyway, today I feel like all the, the things I've done in my life have brought me to work, make me the person I am today. You know, I try to be a great father. Uh, my wife and I, we both teach Sunday school, uh, very involved with youth at church. I uh, love talking uh, uh, about Jesus with anybody and everybody. Um, uh, and uh, you know that's that's just me. Um, 
I'm looking forward to a great year. Uh, God bless. Y'all have a wonderful day.